Welcome back to another video, everyone. If you are new to this channel, I would like to officially welcome you to my channel. My name is Jake, otherwise known as Pac-Man Jake, but I do do some videos on some other sports teams. And this video here is entitled, Why the Indianapolis Colts are Dark Horses to Win the Super Bowl. But before I get started, if you are one of the newcomers, consider subscribing to the channel for more videos like these and give that like button a click to turn it from gray to blue. So let's go through st statistically and logically why the Indianapolis Colts can in fact win Super Bowl 55. Starting with the team stats, we can see where the Colts are ranked both on the offense and defense in each major stat category. Be aware that these stats are subject to change because these only apply to after week 14 of the season. If you're watching this video after week 15, you can go to teamrankings.com to get the weekly updates on the Colts or whichever team you want to see. A link will be in the description. Now let's take a look at the stats where the Colts offense is top 10 in points scored and yards per game. The defense has done an excellent job so far where they are ranked very high in just about every single category. The one thing that jumps out at me is the team's ability to create turnovers. They are second only to the Pittsburgh Steelers so far. One thing that championship defenses do is not only stop teams from scoring points and allowing yards, and that would be creating turnovers. Turnovers can change momentum in games. They give the ball back to your offense to score points. Off, and in some cases, you can score points with an interception or a fumble return for a touchdown. If the Colts can continue to force turnovers, they could be a serious threat defensively in the playoffs. Next, let's go to the team and the key players on the Colts team that makes them legit Super Bowl contenders. Starting with their offensive leader, quarterback Phillip Rivers, who is having a good season. He's not dominating statistically like Patrick Mahomes, Aaron Rodgers, or Russell Wilson, but he's having a season where you can say that he is doing very, very well. A 78.6 pro football focus rating is quite solid so far. Running back Jonathan Taylor is having a good rookie year, but has had to share some carries with other good running backs on the team like Naheim Hines, Marlon Mack, and Jordan Wilkins. T.Y. Hilton may not be as good as he once was, but he is putting, to but he is putting together a solid year and giving Phillip Rivers an option to throw the ball to. Pro Bowl guard Quentin Nelson is having another outstanding year, along with right tackle Ben Braden in helping protect Rivers and can block for their running backs. Young promising tight end Mo Ali Cox is continuing to have another silent season as an all-around tight end as both a blocker and a pass catcher. This is a very good group of players on the offense they, that are working together as a unit and are doing what it takes to win games. Now on to the defense. The defense, led by veteran defensive end Justin Houston, having a very good season with eight sacks on the year so far. Then you have DeForest Buckner, who is terrorizing offensive lines in the interior presence on the defensive line. And then you have Pro Bowl Darius Leonard doing his thing. He's doing a really, really solid job with 72 tackles, one forced fumble. The 70 PFF rating is a little low, but he's doing an outstanding job as the uh, the leader of the linebackers. And then you have two outstanding corners on the defensive backfield. Xavier Rhodes, the veteran, the former Minnesota Viking. And then you have Kenny Moore the second, who has, who has been a very underrated player and is continuing to do an excellent job as an as a diamond in the rough for the Indianapolis Colts and how their defense is playing as a unit this season. And with, like I said before, with this defense playing the way it does, it has a very, very good chance. It has a very, very good chance to take this team to Super Bowl 55. If you made it this far, thanks for watching this video to the very end. I appreciate it. If you're interested in more NFL general videos, just click on one of these videos to the left. I will have more videos like these coming out in the near future. Later, everybody.